The topic of this video is finding the oblique asymptotes of the graph of a rational function. Let's look at a problem. All right, so we're provided with a graph and we're asked to find the oblique asymptote. So this graph has two asymptotes. Uh, sitting on top of the y-axis is a vertical asymptote, and this tilted or slanted dashed line here is the oblique asymptote, and we need to find its equation. To find its equation, there are a couple of things that we need to know. To write the equation of a tilted or a slanted line, you need a slope and a point. So it just so happens that we know two points that are on this particular oblique asymptote. Uh, one of them is the origin. We can see that our dashed line goes right through the point zero, zero. Uh, the other is provided for us in the graph, uh, which is this ordered pair, two comma negative four. With those points, we can determine the slope of our graph. This is actually very easy to do. If you remember that slope is equal to rise over run, then you can track how far you have to travel to get from the origin to this point. So let's do the rise first. We're going down four steps, one, two, three, four. So our rise is negative four. And then we're going to the right two steps, one, two, which gets us to an x-coordinate of two. So our run is positive two. Negative four divided by positive two is negative two. So now we have our slope. So we have one of the two things that we need. The other thing we need is a point, and there are two to choose from. But one of the things we learned in a previous video is if you can choose a point that has an x coordinate of zero, which would make the point a y intercept, then that is the better, easier point to use. Well, we do have such a point. So our y-intercept for this particular slanted line is the ordered pair 0, comma, 0. And using those two pieces of information, we can write the equation of our oblique asymptote using the slope-intercept form for the line y equals mx plus b. m, the slope, is equal to negative 2. b, which is the y-coordinate of the y-intercept, in this case is 0. And simplifying, uh, anything plus zero is itself, so we get y is equal to negative 2x. This is the equation of the oblique asymptote for the graph that's been provided to us.